Welcome Sagittarius. I'm back y'all with another video. All right, so if you are new to my channel, welcome. Come on in. I'll be happy to have you here. Let's see what we got going on for uh, Sagittarius. It's going to be Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, South Node, North Node. So if you have uh, Sagittarius anywhere in that area, you can utilize this video. Also, if you're looking to book a personal reading, guys, all of that information is going to be in the Dropbox below, as well as if you are interested in taking a look at the website, I sell intention oils, um, spiritual pieces, yoni products, um, all of that is going to be in the description box below, all right? Thank you all for your love and support. All right, so let's talk. Sagittarius. Let's see what message we get for y'all. What message is there for Sagittarius, please? What message is there for Sagittarius for the remainder of February? All right, so we got the Eight of Swords that wanted to jump out. All right, Eight of Swords. Let's see. Any of the jumpers here for Sagittarius? All right, so we're going to stop right here. We got the Empress here at the bottom and the Chariot. You could be dealing with the Cancer, a uh, Taurus, or a Libra. All right, but let's see what we got going on here. The Magician. The Sun. The Seven of Cups, Hermit, Hierophant, and the Emperor, King of Swords, Four of Swords, and the King of Cups. Some of you are dealing with a Leo, I got Virgo, I got Taurus, I got Aries. Yeah, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. But I feel like you guys are uh, thinking about a decision. They're thinking about making some type of decision. Okay. Why is the Sun card here? The Six of Swords. So you may be coming to some type of conclusion that you need to move on from a situation. Like you're, you're waking up to the fact that you need to... Uh, let a situation go or move on um, from a situation that you may have been feeling stuck in, okay? I feel like some of y'all are taking more control of your life at this point. You're gaining more discipline and structure. Why is the Six of Swords here? Yeah. Others may look at you as more stricter with the king of swords energy like more in your power just like the way you communicate is could be coming off as kind of blunt um you're speaking your truth here you're speaking your truth and i'm getting like you're making moves okay six of swords here the seven of wands okay um we got strength card here it could be a leo um i feel like you have been giving or someone here could have been giving you something. Um, we got the Six of Pentacles and the Ten of Pentacles here. The Six of Pentacles and the Ten of Pentacles in the Strength card. Why is the Seven of Wands here? The Three of Swords and the Two of Swords. So there's definitely like two to three people involved here. Somebody, okay. Somebody said that they are um, maybe having some issues, financial issues. And somebody didn't lend a helping hand. Why is the Two of Swords here? The Ace of Swords. 
you're seeing the truth of uh, the matter of what a situation is. You're no longer in the dark. I can clearly see that you're no longer in the dark about a situation. Um, I feel like you're kind of having some type of regrets here. Yeah, the Ten of Pentacles. Okay, maybe you gave somebody something. Maybe they were supposed to pay you back or or this could be family oriented. But I feel like there's possibly like money involved in the situation. Okay, I feel like you're feeling really low. I'm getting even kind of like depressed energy. And it could be about money here with the King of Pentacles. You're hoping somebody uh, try to make this right. We got the Star and the Eight of Pentacles. The Queen of Cups and Temperance. Yeah, you're hoping this could be a, a water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. But you're hoping that this person does the right thing and try to balance this situation out. But I feel like right now, I feel like you're uh, you're kind of like stuck. Why is the Eight of Swords here? You're thinking about this. I feel like this is something that you're in your mind contemplating, thinking about. Maybe you're afraid to ask this person. Uh, you're afraid to ask this person or you're thinking about asking this person. Knight of Cups. Why is the Knight of Cups here? Yeah, Six of Pentacles. I feel like you are afraid to... Ask this person for something. Why is the Six of Pentacles here? Eight of Wands. Yeah, like, you are thinking really heavily about the situation. You're thinking about what you're going to say. Because you're trying to make some type of decision. You're spying on this person. You're watching them. You're watching them. You're watching this person. We got the death card here. You're watching them, but you're not saying nothing. And I feel like it could be a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Why is the magician here? The tower card again. You're watching them, but you're not saying anything. Why is the tower here? The Ace of Cups. You're holding back how you really feel. Um, but I feel like y'all are feeling like Queen of Swords. Um, why is the Ace of Cups here? Yeah, Four of Cups. You're disappointed. Which I, I feel like you're not, you don't want to be looked at or seen as like you're bitter or disappointed. But you're disappointed about something. Why is the Seven of Cups here? Four of Pentacles. You, you could be holding on to different options, okay? You could be holding on to different options or you're trying to keep this person around as an option. But this person let you down. Yeah, Knight of Swords. But you, I feel like you're not going to let something happen again. Uh, the Ten of Swords and the Judgment is making that final decision like to end, to end it, um, to end a situation. But I still feel like you're holding on to this person though. I still feel like you're holding on to this person. 
Um, I feel like you're just thinking about this decision. You're thinking about this. I don't feel like you're actually telling this person how you truly feel. Um, the hermit here in the past, like I said, you could be dealing with a Virgo. Um, but it's like you're you're uh, isolating yourself. You isolated yourself from everybody. You like being you like the alone time. Um I'm getting like you like being by yourself. Like you like uh some of y'all have been on a hiatus or you really want your space. You want your space in the past. Like you feel felt like you needed some alone time. Maybe you're waiting for somebody to miss you. You're waiting for, for people to miss you um, or um, come looking for you. Um, so I feel like you ghost, you ghost this person or these people from time to time. Just to kind of make them, you know, wonder. Keep their mind wondering. Now we got the uh, Hierophant here. The Eight of Cups, okay? So, a Taurus could be involved, but somebody here could be walking away. Somebody's trying to stop somebody from walking away. You could be trying to stop somebody from walking away. Like I said, I feel like you don't really like this person. This person disappoints you, but you still hold on to this person. Or this situation. I don't feel like this situation is um, a healthy cycle for you. But I feel like you just don't want to. You don't want to lose this this person or the situation. Like, you're not ready to let it go yet. Now, we got your, your energy as the emperor. And the moon, okay? So, you could be learning how to control your emotions when you're around this person. This person is very special to you. This could be a baby mother. I got the father and the mother card here. This could be definitely a baby mother, baby father situation. Someone here could even possibly be pregnant here with the star and the empress here. Okay, I'm getting as well the king of pentacles, queen of pentacles. Like this is very beautiful energy. You both could be, uh, you know, focused on your coin, focused on your money. Maybe you, you think about you guys being together um, and being secure together. There's just some issues. There's a toxic cycle here, though. There's some type of toxic cycle here. Okay, so maybe you're learning how to control your emotions. You're trying to keep your emotions under un intact. Two of Pentacles. You want to make some type of decision here. I'm getting balance of emotions. You're trying to keep your emotions intact. So this person knocks you off your rocker a little bit when it comes to emotions. This person knows how to tap into um, how to trigger you. Now we got the King of Swords and the Ten of Cups. <laughs> Four of Wands. Someone here could possibly be married. Someone here could already be in a relationship. There's that empress again. Okay. So I feel like you're in your hopes and fears. Your intuition is telling you... Um, that maybe this person needs some type of break or you need some type of break from this person. Um, the Ten of Wands and the Empress. Somebody here is burnt out, okay? You may feel like this person is burnt out. Yeah, Ten of ten of Swords. Maybe you're burnt out, you're tapped out. I feel like some of you um, with the Five of Pentacles and the Three of Pentacles, Maybe you aren't getting a lot of hours at work or there's some type of loss in income. Okay, so I'm getting like somebody's tapping tapping out. Now we got the King of Cups as the outcome. 
okay king of cups and the knight of wands so this is some type of temporary feeling some type of temporary emotion something's temporary here something's very temporary here why is the knight of wands here temperance this is you guys' energy so some of y'all are dealing with yeah like you're gonna try to i feel like you're gonna try to balance this out try to fix this situation because you're temporary feeling like this like this is a temporary emotion like you're just temporarily um not vibing with this situation right now like really i feel like um some of y'all do this to get this person's attention Get this person to communicate with you but i feel like this person this situation is temporary like you feel like this temporarily yeah three of cups and the six of wands it's like um you want to balance this you want to fix this relationship um and come back together i'm getting also a group of people as well too nine of pentacles And the five of swords like some of y'all have um issues with being alone okay some of y'all like to prefer to be in the uh to be in the in crowd but i feel like some of y'all have uh decided to either try to ghost this person um, or some of y'all have been on a hiatus and you're ready to, uh, you're trying to go back out because this is a temporary emotion. Like you temporarily feel like this about this person. So now you're trying to go out, mingle, hang out with other people, possibly to try to keep your mind off of it. Because I feel like some of y'all don't like being alone. Some of you guys have abandonment issues. Like you're afraid of being abandoned or um afraid to just kind of like you just don't like being alone you don't like really being by yourself maybe this person gives you that type of comfort um that's an attachment okay all right so the thing about the attachment is that can be unhealthy. That can be extremely unhealthy, okay? I always go for and lean more towards uh, self-love and not looking for other people to fill voids and things to that nature. Um, whatever works that work, workings that need to be done within self, you can't push that or project that onto other people. Um, oh, I don't like this about myself or I don't like this about this situation. So I'm going to stick a person or I'm going to stick this. You have to do the inner work. Okay. The work has to be done internally. Um, so, the, so the things that you desire manifest um, in your reality. Okay. So um, that's the message that I have for you guys today. If you're interested in booking a personal, all of that information is in the drop box below as well. If you're interested in ordering from the website, um, I sell intention oils. They are handmade and prepared by me, as well as Joni Care uh, items, as well as jewelry pieces, okay? Spiritual pieces, all right? All that information is in the drop box below, and I'm going to chat with y'all later. Thank you for watching. Ciao.